So we're back again with now another NBA 2K18 My Team gameplay, and I gotta say, I am so excited to do this one. So with the recent season of Supermax finally completing, we knew the reward for a long time, and it was Diamond Clyde Drexler. And finally, when I have a look in my rewards queue, you can see we've got this rewards pack, and below it says Diamond Clyde Drexler. So we're gonna open this up, and hopefully we can get him. Hopefully there's no glitch, because I heard that there was at the start, but I think it should be all good now as we get the diamond flash right there and we're going to flip the card see this Clyde Drexler he should be an absolute beast get the little animation to go and I love Clyde Drexler in this game I'm a Portland fan myself there we go Clyde Drexler welcome to the squad now the crazy thing is I've never seen the stats on this card so it's going to be a surprise to me of how he is because he's not on 2k MT central or anything so you can see the card here it looks absolutely nice as and for now he's only 400 cap at a 97 overall which is just beastly and then he's six foot seven 99 offensive and 99 defensive overalls 97 driving layup, 88 post fadeaway, 80 post control, 97 draw foul, 97 shot close, 96 open shot mid range with an 88 three, which I actually do like a lot. 92 free throw, 88 ball control. Dude, I can already tell you this card's an absolute monster with his rebounding stats being really nice too. And his defense is insane. He has 96 lateral quickness, 97 steal, 97 shot contest. And you guys know Clyde Drexler, his dunking stats have to be good. And I can tell you what, um, they definitely are. This shooting guard, Clyde Drexler, has a 95 standing dunk, 98 driving dunk, 98 contact dunk, 97 speed, 88 speed with ball, 97 cell, 98 vertical, and to go with all that 98 stamina, you can see my reaction to this card. Like, I'm so happy I grinded for him. Please say the tendencies are both at 100, and yes, they are, so that's all you need. The system proficiencies are super nice across the board, and it's time for the badges. As I said, I've got no idea, so let's have a look. Five Hall of Fame badges, including one man five break relentless finisher post a lob city finisher and tyler scorer and i gotta say those badges are extremely good and then he comes with 11 gold badges being pickpocket difficult shots catch and shoot defensive stopper and acrobat so after looking at this clyde stats to say that i'm excited to do this gameplay is legitimately an understatement you can see the team right now on screen is looking absolutely insane with of course clyde drexler shooting guard and yeah i definitely want to see what he can do so without further ado let's get into this first game so i'm pretty hyped because it's legitimately taking me an an hour to find a game and I know he doesn't have the best team but it's gonna have to do unfortunately this game though we do have some pretty similar uniforms which I actually haven't had the whole time of me playing this game I've never gone against like the same sort of smoky as I do but let's try and play good defense on the first possession which we sort of do he scores anyway but yo you would know exactly what I'm doing Clyde Drexler on the drive first play can he get a dunk or finish that or he'll miss it. Okay, so we've got seven seconds on the clock. Let's just drive straight by him. Go up and get free throws. If I'm being honest, that's what I thought was going to happen last time. Let's see his free throw release. And it's pretty nice. It's cash. I don't think I should miss any of these. 91%. He won't. Oh, yeah. I see you, Clyde. I see you for the mid. He's got to make that one. Let's go. Yo, I need like a crazy dunk just to hype me up a little bit. Let's go past him and... Why isn't he dunking that? To be honest, that does sort of scare me to think that he might not even have any dunk packages. Let's try and get one here. Can he dunk that? He's dunking it now. And don't worry, I do know that's very cheese. Let's go baseline here. Can he dunk it again? He's not, not, he's not, not dunking now. I don't know. Please don't quit. I mean, he's already got 10 points. Can we make that 13 with the three? He hits it. To be honest, I remember in previous years, I hated his release. But right now, I'm actually doing pretty well with this release. And he's starting to bring double teams, which means it's time for the assist. Yeah, let's just kick it to again he's absolutely destroying we can just go baseline and jam it once again oh i see clay he's going to the corner let's get a pump fake there go past whoever's defending him and jam it and one yeah um so far i can tell this card is pretty op to be honest i don't know why at the start he didn't dunk it for me i thought he was definitely going to do that but there's another one this is so cheese right now and i'm not denying that let's try and get another three or is, yeah i think it's gonna have to be a two let's pull the mini heavily contested doesn't matter it does, but he's going to be wide open for three. Good release. Will he make that? Of course he will. So in the first quarter, he had 23 points and make that 26 now. Wait, no, 25. What am I saying? Hey, yo, we got another stop. My team is playing such nice defense too. Let's go, Clyde. Let's just go up there. Can he make the layup? Okay, just missing, but going to the corner. 
Wide open for another three. Three of three. Let's go. He's hitting every single one. Like, he seriously hasn't missed a three. Can I throw a lob here? Why not? Let's try it. Clyde Drexler finishes it off. He has 30 points already. And I sort of want to add at least two more here. Can we get three, maybe? Oh, no. Let's give it to the Sun White side. Give it back out. Go on the drive. Can he jam it on someone? Getting more free throws. I mean, he hasn't got that crazy poster yet, which I am waiting for. But the thing that he does have is 32 points in a quarter and a half. And I just called my bench on, so they're going to come on soon. But we're just going back baseline and that was a nice animation to know that he can get those acrobatic animations really does excite me because some players that can get those can do the most crazy layup animations oh yeah give me that steal he says and let's just run this up let's go skirt skirt inside go straight up and jam it home bro my defense this game has been absolutely insane i don't know why it's been so good let's just rush right there take the little midi he misses that one but every time he misses we seem to get the board and i'm running him at point guard right now off the bench. Let's go inside. Can he finish that one? He probably will. No, he doesn't. He misses it, but he's going to the corner. Wide open for another three. Bad release. It doesn't matter. I straight up don't understand why his three-pointer has been so good. Can he make that one too? There's no way. Okay, had to miss one sometime soon. But let's just go inside here. Do a little spin. Go up. up. Okay, that's such a bad shot. Would not recommend you take that shot. But every time we miss, we get the board. Another three. Okay, I was very excited. I thought he was going to make that one. How about another one? Let's go there. Oh, what? Another steal animation. You know me. I'm doing a flashy. There we go. Like, he's shooting over 60%, which is just insane. Running down here, postering him once again. The best thing is, is I'm pretty sure I remember he has Hall of Fame Tyler score. And that's seriously one of my favorite Hall of Fame badges because... When I do this type of game, he's just able to destroy every single minute. Going up there, you can see what I'm saying. Let's just try and go past Brandon. Okay, that's not going to work. Let's just play it safe. Kick it out to him here. Give it to D-Rob for another assist. Why not? He's actually an extremely good point guard as we're able to get probably another assist here with LeBron, of course. I seriously haven't noticed he's tied. And that's one of my favorite things about him. Getting another dunk there. And that there was point number 50. Can we make it 52 with the fading mini? That's his shot every day. Oh yeah, another steal. Another steal. Let's just run this up with Clyde and take the other dunk. This is one of the most dominant games I think I've done. Like, I know it's pretty damn cheesy what I'm doing. Taking another midi there, because why not? One thing I haven't... Oh, what? The... I did not want to take that. Okay, that's all right, though, because we get the board. And let's take a heavily contested midi. Yeah, you probably shouldn't take heavily contested shots. Going there, though. Taking an open one and making that one. Oh, no. He's going to quit. Clyde had 59 points. We're at the free throw line. About to get 60. That was an insane game. Now, luckily, his stats did show up just for a little bit so i'll show them right here and you can see it was pretty damn good of a game so i'm definitely happy with how this clyde played because the team played extremely well too but now i'm going to hop into a game where i just play with him normally and sub him out and everything so this should be a good one to see what he can do so without further ado let's get into it and it's taken me 30 minutes to find this next game and again he doesn't really have the best team but it's just gonna have to do and we're on the home court right now so i'm a little bit hyped hopefully clyde can play well in his first home game let's win this tip real quick which is exactly what we do. And as I said, I'm playing normally, so let's give it there. Give it down to Clyde. Go baseline, just cheesing hard and getting foul. I'll take it. It wasn't a shooting foul, but that's all right. We get the pump fake there and let's just go, I don't know, just straight past Kobe. It's too easy with Clyde Drexler going up and getting the two. And yeah, we're running out once again, giving it to Paul George. Wide open three. You know he's not okay. He is missing that. It is pretty annoying with the teams that I'm going against, but I can't really do much about it because it is preseason right now. Not really anyone's playing competitively which means the teams aren't usually the best. And also it's really early in the morning. So there's not too many people on, but we get a free throw there. And of course, one of one. And you guys already know, we make that two of two. All right, let's just kick it to him again. Go baseline once again and post it. There we go. Like, yes, I know what I'm doing is super cheesy, but it's just what you got to do as we get another assist with the three from PG. My team ever since we ever added Clyde has actually been playing so nice as he gets a nice poster there too. Because usually when I add a new player, I don't know why, it just feels like my team just Play so much worse. Let's bump by there. Another poster, dude. He's killing it with the dunks this game. So far, to be honest, I think I'm very happy with this card. Another blow by animation, but we wanted the assist with Wes Unsell. PG wide open. You know, it's another assist to Clyde Drexler. My team's just playing perfect defense, and I'm really confused as to why. Another wide open three doesn't miss them from downtown. Dude, I'm missing like every shot now. I don't know why. Not with Clyde. Going up there, though, he's not missing. Oh, okay. He's bringing a double team, and that's just a straight GG for the assist. My team is playing so well, and I do not know why. Let's go up. Another dunk. That's his signature one, too. And I haven't subbed him out yet, because he's just continued to be killing it for me every single possession. So 
Maybe when he does something bad, I might have to kick it up to here. Going inside. Can he finish that one? There's no way. Okay, that might be the time to take him off. All right, I see you. Inside. Going up. Can he make that one? Free throws. I'll take it. Hey, yo, we've got another fast break. I'm just getting them left, right, and center. And that's such a good shot with Clyde Drexler. All right, I see you, baby. A little step back. Yeah, but that's that's money. That's cash every single day. There's only one player on the court now that's hot, and it's Clyde Drexler. I'm seriously trying to sub him out, but I just can't because he gets free throws every time. And free throws means two points, I can tell you that. Inbound steal, there we go. Spin, and then just go up. Okay, he's got to make that anyway. I was definitely thinking that should have been an N1. Let's... Dude, that's the standing dunk right there. To think that a shooting guard can do that, I mean, it's pretty crazy. Another wide open three. Yeah, he might have to come off now. I seriously have been trying to sub him out for like the last three minutes. But as I said, he just doesn't want to come off. And he's just getting free throws every single time. Missing that one there. Go out, Clyde. Go out. Okay, let's just take this assist. LeBron James in the corner. Splash. And finally, I've subbed him out. So we've now got 100% of my bench on, including D-Wade, who's getting free throws right there. And uh, yeah, that's the end of the game. He quit. Luckily, though, I was pretty sure that he was going to quit. So I did check the stats just before the game ended. So here they are. And yeah, you can see he definitely did have an extremely good game. And unfortunately, this is the annoying thing about it being preseason, is you can just never find games, at least for me. Because I've been recording this video for now three hours to just try and find a game and I've only played for like 40 minutes. So yeah, I'm sorry I could only show two like half games of Clyde Drexler, but it's just because I've been searching for so long. But it was pretty crazy in those two games. In the first one, I dropped 60 points and in the second, I had over 20. So that's over 80 points in pretty much one game. So now the question is, should you be disappointed if you didn't get this Diamond Clyde Drexler? Now I think my straightaway answer would be yes, but the thing about it is it was a huge grind. Like I think I played over 180 games to get this card. And I mean, that's definitely a lot in about six weeks, I think it was. So I don't know. I think it was probably worth it for me, but that's just because personally, I really do enjoy playing this game, like playing people online. I enjoy it. So I enjoyed those games that I played and I'm happy I was able to get this Diamond Clyde as my reward. My own only question is, should I put this diamond shoe on him? Because it will give him a 97.3 and also 97 ball control. So I don't know. I'm seriously considering it. Let me know down below if I should. Because this is going to be my squad. I'm definitely going to run him at backup point guard. So I think he should be an absolute beast with 97 ball control and 97.3 off the bench. But yeah, as I said, I apologize. I could only do two half games this video, but hopefully you guys understand. But without a doubt, this Clyde is an absolute beast. So I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to smash that like button if you did. Also, be sure to subscribe if you're new and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye.